as he walked through some of Burlington's most flooded areas, House Speaker Paul Ryan made it clear he's focused on one thing. The word right now is safety. Our goal is to make sure that we keep everybody safe. The Fox River flooding knocked out power to thousands. Many roads are still impassable. Ryan said that all pales in comparison, though, to the human toll this flood could have taken. I am so impressed with our first responders. I want to say thank you to our first responders. And I am just so thankful that there has never there has not been a loss of life, that the injuries have been very minor. Ryan said the next step is figuring out if the damage is costly enough to allow federal disaster assistance. It will take us some time to figure this out. It will take a while to figure out just what kind of damage we're talking about here. But I, this was, I was here in the 2007 flood. This is so much more devastating than the 2007 flood. That flood damage was bad enough for FEMA to step in. As the community recovers tonight, the police chief wants to make sure no one is left out. We're getting through this. And by helping us and checking your neighbors, we're going to get through this. And that curfew tonight is going to last until 6 o'clock tomorrow morning. I, I asked the police chief as well uh, how long he expects this to keep going. He said that he wouldn't be surprised if this curfew lasted another night as well. Live in Burlington, Ben Wagner, WISN 12 News.